Hello, I'm going to show you how to fix an Unreal process has crashed in Arc Raiders. So let's start with the first method. Go to the Windows search bar and type in NVIDIA. Make sure you open the NVIDIA app. If you don't find it displaying like this, make sure to download it from their official website. Now after this opens, make sure to log in with your information. After that, go to settings in the left menu and make sure to turn off the NVIDIA overlay. Now once you do that, go to the drivers in the left menu. After that, make sure to download and install the latest available driver you'll find. Select Express installation and click on continue. Now for the next method, go to the search and type in device manager. It will open like this. Now look for processors, open it, select anyone, right click and select update driver. Now click search automatically for drivers. After that click close. Do the same thing and look for display adapters. Select the NVIDIA or AMD graphics card, right click update driver, search automatically and then close. Now for the next step, go to the Steam launcher or any launcher that you have the game on, open it, you will be redirected right here. So go to the top left corner and select the Steam logo. After that, click on check for Steam client updates. If you do have an older version, the download button will be appearing next to the close button. If it's not appearing, then you have the newest version and you're good to go. So select close. After that, go to library and select collections. Now in the left menu, you can search for the game Arc Raiders. Now you need to select it. After that, you need to go to this manage option in the right and then click on properties. Next, in the launch options, make sure to type this command dash dx11. After that, go to installed files in the left menu and select verify integrity of game files. Just wait for the process to finish and it will be downloading any corrupted or missing file it will find. Next, go to the taskbar. After that, select this upside arrow. Now go to your antivirus. For example, I have Avast. Right click and then go to manage shields. Select disable for 10 minutes or a short period of time. After that, go to upper quarantine. Here, if you do find any file related to the game, you should just select it. After that, click on these three dots and select restore and add exception. If you don't have this as an option, just go to the Windows security. After that, select protection against threats and viruses. Scroll down, select manage settings, then scroll all the way down. You'll find this exclusion section. So select add or delete exclusions. After that, select add an exclusion and select folder. Here, just go to the C drive, search for programs 86, like this, open it. Now search for Steam or the launcher that you have the game on and make sure to select this folder. Now for the next method, go to the Windows search again and type in view advanced system settings. It will appear like this, so go to settings. After that, go to advanced, which is the second one, and then select change. Make sure to uncheck this box right here. After that, select custom size. In the initial and maximum size, it depends on your RAM. So for the initial size, it is 1.5 times your RAMs. And for the maximum, it's three times your RAMs. So make sure to fill in these blanks and select OK. And that's it. Hope the problem is fixed. If you find it helpful, consider subscribing and see you on the next one.